In some versions of Greek mythology, Zeus ate his wife Metis because it was known that their second child would be more powerful than him. After Metis's demise, their first child Athena was born when Hephaestus cleaved Zeus's head open and the goddess of war emerged, fully grown and armed. The story of Zeus swallowing Metis is a fascinating and often perplexing tale in Greek mythology. The act of a father swallowing his pregnant wife is certainly not something that one hears about every day, and it raises many questions about the nature of Zeus and his relationship with Metis. To understand this perplexing myth, we must delve into the background of Zeus, Metis, and the circumstances surrounding their fateful encounter. Zeus, the king of the gods, was known for his insatiable appetite for power and his relentless pursuit of dominance. Metis, on the other hand, was a powerful and cunning goddess, often associated with wisdom and craftiness. It was said that Metis possessed the ability to change shape and transform into various forms, making her a formidable adversary, even for Zeus himself. According to the myth, Zeus learned of a prophecy that foretold the birth of a child who would surpass him in power. This child was to be born to Metis, his wife. Fearing the potential threat to his authority, Zeus made the decision to swallow Metis whole, in an attempt to prevent the prophecy from coming to fruition. The act of swallowing Metis not only resulted in her demise but also had unforeseen consequences for Zeus himself. Shortly after consuming Metis, Zeus began to suffer from excruciating headaches. The pain was so unbearable that he called upon Hephaestus, the god of fire and forge, to relieve him of his agony. Hephaestus, using his great skill, cleaved open Zeus's head with an axe, and from the wound emerged Athena, fully grown and armed, the embodiment of wisdom and strategic warfare. <laughs>